Open world games with crafting are truly amazing as they offer immense freedom to players, allowing you to explore a vast virtual world in whichever way you prefer. You can choose which missions or activities to undertake, discover hidden secrets, interact with characters, and much more. Additionally, the crafting system adds an extra layer of depth to the game. With it, you can collect resources and create your own items, weapons, and equipment. This gives a sense of progression and customization, as you can tailor your equipment to your preferences and gameplay strategies. That's why in today's video, I bring you the top 10 open world and crafting games for PC that you need to play in 2024. So make sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss anything. Terraria is an action-adventure game released in 2011, developed by Relogic. It was initially released for Windows and later ported to other PC and console platforms. The game takes place in a 2D procedurally generated open world. One of Terraria's main features is exploration. Players have the freedom to explore a vast world full of different biomes, such as forests, deserts, caves, and dungeons. During exploration, you will encounter a variety of creatures, from common enemies to powerful bosses. In addition to exploration, the game also features a comprehensive crafting system. Players can collect natural resources such as wood, ores, and plants, and use them to create a wide variety of items, weapons, armor, and tools. Don't Starve is a dark fantasy survival game created by Cly Entertainment and released in April 2013. In the game, you take on the role of Wilson, a fearless scientist who has been trapped by a demon and transported to a wild and mysterious world. To escape and find your way back home, Wilson must learn to explore the environment and its inhabitants using science and magic. Don't Starve is an open world game that gives you a lot of freedom to explore and interact with the environment around you. You can collect resources, hunt animals, cultivate food, build shelters, and face challenges to survive. The game also features a crafting system where you can combine different items and materials to create new equipment, tools, and structures. The Forest is a survival horror game developed and published by N Night Games. The game is set on a remote and densely forested peninsula, where the main character, Eric LeBlanc, must fight against cannibalistic monsters while searching for his son Timmy after a plane crash. The game features non-linear gameplay in an open-world environment, played in first-person perspective, similar to a simulator. In the game, you have complete freedom to explore the environment, build shelters, hunt animals, collect resources, and craft items to survive. You can chop down trees to build camps, start fires to keep warm, search for food to avoid hunger, and plant seeds to grow food. Additionally, you can also confront the cannibals that inhabit the forest, using improvised weapons or traps to defend yourself. Dying Light is a first-person survival game set in a post-apocalyptic scenario. In it, you find yourself in a city devastated by an epidemic virus, filled with hungry undead. The world of Dying Light is vast and open for exploration. You can traverse the city, climb rooftops, explore abandoned buildings, and discover hidden secrets. The environment is dynamic, with a day and night cycle. During the day, you can explore more safely, but at night, the zombies become more aggressive and dangerous. One of the central mechanics of the game is crafting. You can collect materials and create your own weapons, healing items, and upgrades. There are crafting stations scattered throughout the world, where you can combine components to create more powerful weapons or useful items.
Valheim is a survival and exploration game set in a brutal and mysterious Viking world. Released in February 2021 for PC via Steam, it offers an immersive experience with elements of open world and crafting. Valheim features a vast open world to explore. You can traverse dense forests, snow-covered mountains, dark swamps, and vast oceans. Each biome has its own challenges, enemies, and unique resources. Exploration is key to finding new locations, resources, and secrets. The crafting system in Valheim is essential for your survival. You can create a variety of items, from tools and weapons to armor and structures. Materials are collected from natural resources such as wood, stone, metal, and leather. Crafting stations, such as workbenches and forges, are used to create more advanced items. Pal World is an open world and crafting game that combines elements of Pokemon and Minecraft. The player creates a character and embarks on a journey in an open world, completing missions, participating in battles, and challenges. The gameplay is in third person, with some shooting elements, allowing the player to freely control their character on the map, interacting with creatures called Pals, collecting resources, and building. The game features a crafting system, allowing the player to create items and objects such as tools, weapons, a house, a bed, and a campfire. This facilitates survival and progression in the game. The pals, which are creatures inspired by Pokemon, can be captured and used to assist with tasks such as resource gathering or building. Raft is a popular survival game where players find themselves stranded in the middle of the ocean and must survive by building and expanding their raft, collecting resources, fighting threats like sharks, and exploring the open sea. The game offers a unique crafting and survival experience in a vast and dynamic environment. Players need to scavenge floating debris in the water to expand their raft, collect resources to create tools, weapons, and shelter, and navigate various challenges to stay alive. Raft's open-world setting allows players to explore different islands, encounter wildlife, and discover secrets while constantly adapting to the changing conditions of the ocean. The crafting aspect of the game is essential, requiring players to combine materials to create items necessary for survival and progression, making strategic decisions about what to build and prioritize to increase their chances of survival in this adventure. Days Gone is an open-world action-adventure game set in a post-apocalyptic environment. In it, players take on the role of Deacon St. John, a bounty hunter, as he fights for survival in a world infested with creatures known as Freakers. The game offers players the freedom to explore a vast post-apocalyptic environment. The game map is extensive and diverse, with a variety of territories such as forests, mountains, open fields, and abandoned cities. Players can traverse the world on foot or by motorcycle facing various challenges and encountering NPCs along the way. Additionally, Days Gone features a crafting system that allows players to create a variety of useful items for survival. Players can craft ammunition, first aid kits, weapons, traps, and other items needed to face the dangers of the post-apocalyptic world. To create these items, players need to find recipes, collect materials, and have access to a workbench. Astroneer is a multiplayer space exploration game developed by System Era Softworks. Players take on the role of a lost astronaut from the 25th century who wants to return to their home planet after an accident isolates them on one of the alien worlds in their solar system. The game takes place during a 25th century gold rush, where players must explore the outer reaches of space, risking their lives and resources in hostile environments for a chance to strike it rich. Astroneer's open world can be explored alone or with friends, with up to four players. Astroneer offers the ability to acquire construction materials and thus be able to create your own spaceship. Players can explore different planets and collect materials to build and create, with resources naturally found by digging the terrain or exploring the planets.
Core Keeper is an open world and crafting game set in a forgotten cave, full of secrets to be discovered. It offers an open world environment where players can dynamically evolve the cave, uncover secrets, gather relics and resources, and face giant monsters. Additionally, players can cultivate plants, fish in mysterious waters, and customize their characters to venture even further into the caves. The game offers a wide range of crafting options, allowing players to craft new equipment, armor, and items to help them in their underground journey. The crafting system offers a variety of recipes and items that players can create to enhance their gaming experience. Now I want to know your list of favorite open world and crafting games. Tell me everything in the comments section so we can discuss together. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and give the video a like. I'll be signing off for now. Take care and see you next time.